Hello, dear ones. It's Alice. I am of the stars. And I have a very interesting addition to the stories regarding um, subconscious mind and symbolism. I'll call this story fictional. <laughs> um, okay, so imagine that there might be a group of people in the world, um, a hypothetical group of people in the world, who um, whose purpose as a group is to to be a con operation. I'm sure you've imagined such a thing before. So, so it's such a group would their their motto might be um, to sucker people. You know that term, sucker people, or to um, to to get people to be patsies, to get money from them, and so forth. So the motto of a hypothetical con operation, we'll sucker you. And, and that doesn't mean help, you know, S-U-C-C-O-U-R, as in sucker or aid. It means sucker, S-U-C-K-E-R, as in um, we'll, we'll rob you and loot you and so forth, right? Sucker you. So, um... <laughs> So there's this term, and suppose the leader, the, the, this hypothetical group had a leader that preferred um, preferred male-to-male um, -male contact in the sexual realm. And this person and the group was both men and women, right? And so suppose, um, and we're talking about astral negative stories playing out right now, that's all. Um, not, not physical reality. <laughs> so... Um, so suppose he, his sub subconscious, very deep subconscious mind, had the notion that if the women were to offer him the sexual service of, what is it called, um, when, when a woman orally stimulates a man's sexual organs? So suppose in his subconscious mind he were to say this is that they would lollipop him, you know. He would be their lollipop, right? And so you can see here what is going on is, is a play in the subconscious mind between the word sucker, which the unconscious and subconscious don't know really what the meaning of it is. They see, you know how concrete the, the unconscious imaging is? It's very physical. And the word sucker means to the unconscious mind a lollipop. It doesn't mean some abstract thing, right? Neither help or aid nor um, uh, patsying somebody. It doesn't mean any of that. It means lollipop, the little kid thing, right? And so um, if everybody in this organization suckers people, and if the leader can get the women whom he doesn't really prefer in a sexual context to to sucker him, then their instinct to sucker is satisfied through the sex act that aligns their, um, their, their, as I've mentioned before, it aligns their psychic cords to him sexually. And the, and the man then feels comfortable and protected to go out and go ahead and have sexual relations with men. Now, if this man is married, which is a complication, a societal complication, due to societal expectations, suppose he were married, then the, the astral play in the, in the dark uh, network, in the deep unconscious realm, would be for him to, to whenever a woman who is bound to him um, psychically because of this, this mix-up and this... this act of oral copulation that's taking place with all the women in the group. Um, these women are heterosexual and approach him sexually, then he will bounce them to his wife in the deep unconscious. You can hear it happening. My wife, take care of this, right? And she will attempt to relate to them woman to woman to, to, so that their unwanted energy will be diverted from his own. Now, the other ramification of such a, like a misalignment of energies and like redirect and 
really uh, the need for an unconscious clearing is all that's going on here. Um, the other un unfortunate ramification is that the women who do, who succored the leader will be divorced from from their own husbands because the psychic cords that are developed have to do with them and the leader. So their husbands will wander off into new relationships. Mm -hmm. That's that's my opinion about it. And all the men in the group will be um, naturally drawn to the male male interaction in the sexual realm. That's if that's if the leader is like that. So so basically, this is just about sucker lollipop and how that can get mixed up with with um, actual acting out in the physical realm during the ascension process. It's a wild story, <laughs> I have to say. Good thing it's hypothetical.